Freiburg is Germany's greenest city and was the first city in the country to vote in a green mayor. The region regards itself as environmentally pioneering. Clean energy is in, nuclear power is out. Demonstrations against atomic energy are regularly held in the middle of the city. No wonder one of the most experienced solar technology companies in Europe is located here. The Solar Fabrik Company in Freiburg produces 800,000 modules for photovoltaic facilities a year for France, Italy and Germany. People here in the Black Forest are proud that their region is a leader in environmental protection. There is a long tradition here in research and development and environmental thinking. Last year, the German government's decision to extend the lifespan of Germany's nuclear power plants came as a blow to the solar energy industry. But the CEO of Solar Fabrik says the crisis in Japan is a political turning point toward alternative energy. Of course, we hope that if the extension is retracted, then consumers and investors, for example municipalities, will build up their own energy supply and invest in solar parks. And that business, which dropped to zero for us in the first quarter, will revive. Schönau in the Black Forest, about 40 kilometers from Freiburg. Here, even the church has a solar roof. At the end of the 1990s, the citizens of Schönau bought out their electricity supplier. Now their electricity comes primarily from hydroelectric plants in Norway, and they resell it all over Germany. Since the reactor disaster in Japan, up to 300 new customers are signing up every day. That's the former weekly growth rate. And so the company is expanding and needs to extend the building. Michel Schladek is overseeing the construction, making sure the energy-saving features are in place. He tells us that customers of the big energy companies can't verify whether their electricity comes from nuclear plants. If you want to switch to ecological electricity, you need to know not only how the electricity is produced, but also where the money goes. The only way to change the economy is to change the flow of money at the same time. Back to Freiburg and the Fraunhofer Institute. This branch of the institute is specialized in solar technology and is researching how Germany can shift to alternative energy. The Fraunhofer Institute tests equipment for solar energy companies. Everyone here is convinced that a nuclear exit and a complete switch to alternative energy are feasible. It depends how urgently we push the issue. We've made studies, together with other research institutions, that show it can definitely be done by 2050. But if we work harder at it, it's easy to imagine that we can switch entirely by 2030. People in Freiburg are banking on solar power, even though the sun doesn't always shine here. They wish all of Germany would follow their energy-saving example.